For decades, unguided dumb bombs were the standard in aerial warfare. These simple iron bombs relied solely on gravity and the pilot's skill, often missing targets by hundreds of meters. The collateral damage was staggering. In Vietnam, it took an average of 176 bombs to destroy a single target. This inefficiency created an urgent need for precision that could turn existing bomb stockpiles into smarter weapons without complete redesign. Enter the Joint Direct Attack Munition, JDM, a $25,000 tail kit that transforms dumb bombs into smart weapons. By combining GPS and inertial navigation, INS, JDM-equipped bombs achieve 5-meter accuracy in any weather. The genius lies in its simplicity. Existing bomb bodies get new tail fins, guidance computers, and GPS receivers. Over 80% of the original weapon remains unchanged, making this one of the most cost-effective upgrades in military history. JDAM's secret weapon is its dual GPS INS guidance system. If GPS signals are jammed, the inertial navigation system takes over using gyroscopes and accelerometers. The tail fins adjust position 20 times per second during descent. Even at Mach 0.8 speeds, JDAMs can hit moving targets by receiving mid-course updates. This reliability explains why over 450,000 JDAM kits have been produced, turning old bombs into weapons that outperform many modern missiles at a fraction of the cost. The 2003 Iraq War proved JDAM's combat value. During the shock and awe campaign, B-2 Spirits dropped 80 JDAMs simultaneously with pinpoint accuracy. One notable strike destroyed an entire Iraqi command center while leaving adjacent buildings intact. Compared to laser-guided bombs, JDAMs work through sandstorms and smoke. This reliability has made them the weapon of choice. Over 40,000 JDAMs were used in Iraq and Afghanistan, accounting for 75% of all precision strikes. What began as a simple tail kit evolved into a strategic revolution. JDAMs demonstrated that precision doesn't require expensive new weapons just smarter modifications. Today's JDAM ER variants glide over 45 miles, while laser JDAM hybrids combine both guidance methods. This innovation pipeline all started with recognizing the untapped potential in existing bomb stockpiles. The next time you hear, it's just a tale, remember, sometimes the simplest solutions deliver the most explosive results.